Well, I, I like to start. <laughs> uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to uh, Taiwan and to attend the architects' uh, dinner meeting. Uh, 我我講個中文啊,謝謝謝謝呃結華還有王王小姐來參加我們那個代理商會議啊。呃呃this uh, uh, is the first time first time we have the global dinner meeting. Uh and the first time we in the in the SMA in SMA in all the exhibition and the second time in in the 209. Uh now remember this is the financial storm. So it's the uh not the Economy situation not good. The third time in our factory, we have 10 years anniversary. Uh, you can pay your attention and uh, to to all of our uh, presentation later, and uh, hope you have a, a good afternoon. And uh, you can we can communicate each other to for all of, all of our sales uh, for next next year. And this year, since. Welcome, Liz. I have to introduce everyone to you because I need you to in this chance to know each other, because it will be your only chance. I can know everyone, but not everyone know each other. So later I will introduce. Then I will talk about sales roadmap from 2002 to 2013, and the report before 2013, and how to increase production capacity and the new machine releasing, as you can see in the booth, and the full series of machines, and architects vision. Okay, Korea, Mr. Kim, please stand up. <laughs> this is uh, Mr. Hello. Kim from STC company. He's an Korean agent. Uh, hello, everybody. Yes, yeah. <laughs> very good. And uh, Mr. Cho, a very important sales director in some Gumi area. And others didn't show up. And next one is South Africa. Mr. Les Potter. Yeah. Okay, Mr. Steven Andrews. <laughs> and Poland and Blanford's consulting is also Mr. Thomas. And Russia, Igor. <laughs> Tina. <laughs> Tina is a his translator, okay? And Andre, the service manager, a very important one. Turkey, Poland. Yeah, everyone. Merhaba. Now China, Mr. Zhu. Zhu Zhonglai. Show it up. Now Wang Ping. Slovenia, Tomo. <laughs> okay, Hungary is our new agent from last year. So they keep uh, keep fighting with Sodic because he told me Hungary is a Sodic country. So, <laughs> so we can share the experience, Gabor. And it's Istvan. Yeah. Belong to Hungary Optimum. India is our new agent, Mr. Naresh Kumar. He is focusing on the tender. And Mr. All right, all right. Welcome. Thailand, Idea Tooling, and the Pierce is a very new, tough young guy and fighting with more orders, so I appreciate him and also coming by his wife, Zhang Noi. And another Thai, because just come today, Mr. Son, Entech, also from Thailand. Sri Lanka didn't show up, Romania. Mr. Gane. Yeah. And uh, Sylvia didn't, didn't come. Julian. They are belong to two companies. One IP Automatic is a factory. They're using our machine directly. Just buy directly and using them promote by, by PNG. So it's a trading company and a factory combination together. Okay. New Zealand. Christian. And the uh, rain didn't show up, so I don't know why. Egypt, Syed! Egypt, everybody concerned about your country, okay? <laughs> Share your experience. Japan, Yamaguchi-san. Ichiro-san. Chile, uh, you see so many people, but no one show up. <laughs> they told me everyone. <clears throat> we 
will come for the meeting and dinner, so I'm afraid that they will come only meeting, only dinner. Peru also not, not show up. Okay. Sales roadmap from 2002 to 2013. You can see from 2002, only small unit. Until 2012, we just reached 200 more, a little bit. And this year is a very high target, 3, 3, 320 unit. We are going to reach it. So far, we have sold 2,234 until 2012 year. So just in have some idea, what, what are we going to do this year? It's a so the record that I have been calculated for the current uh, recent three years. Want to know how Korean guy do the great job? Mr. Kim is here. <laughs> Later, maybe he can share his experience. So this is the whole totally map because I, I try to develop the, the country by country, but sometimes the most important country is right now is in Korea and the USA. So in your mind, maybe you have some idea how to fight with the SOLIC. Yeah. So how do you establish Equitex name? Sometimes I will ask end user, other end user, do you know Equitex name? Their answer is a half and half because it depends on the agent. If they focus on this market, do something. If they don't do anything, they don't know Equitex name. So how do you create your sales volume? And uh, this is the way I heard by media, direct sales, AD website, exhibitions. What else you can do? I don't know. If you have more ideas, share with me. He is, he is the first agent in Equitex for us. So I would like him to share his experience, how to sell Equitex, the, the idea, with us. Now welcome Mr. Stephen Andrews. And I think one of the things that I want to share, share with you is maybe a different way of selling. And if you go to a coffee shop, it's, it's all about an experience. And we have to learn how to create this experience amongst ourselves in Accutex. So my first question and my questions, a lot of them are direct to the factory, is innovation only technical? And I don't believe it is. I believe we can have innovative sales pitches. For example, every salesman should have a case with samples in it. So in other words, when they go visit the client, um, they should have a sample of, of what the client is cutting. You see a lot of samples downstairs at the exhibition, but we actually need to carry those with us and show those to our clients. It's a tactile thing. When somebody holds something in their hand, they want to buy it. Okay, and then as far as uh, marketing goes, I think Maybe architects should choose one country, for, you know, you know, for example, where they're fighting with Sodic, and offer a very special price, <laughs> and try to fight in one country from the bottom up. In, a, in other words, a lost looter. Lose money in that area, but build a market there. And, and then financial. I don't think we think uh, enough about the financial side of buying a machine. You know, a lot of us are technical. We're selling to the guy on the shop floor. The fact is, the accountants are making the decisions. So maybe we need some financial products. You know, Siemens are offering a financial product. There's a lot of financial products going around there. And maybe we should think about amortizing the machines or talking to banks about amortizing machines over a longer period. And maybe with a payment holiday for the first year. These are all ideas you can put across to your clients to try to help you. Ideas we've used in South Africa, where we've undercut, not undercut, we've sold at a higher price but giving the customers a good way to make money from the start. So these are ideas for the factory. Uh, how do we, you know, we determine our price. We push the, high, the price as high as possible and wait for the customer to say no. But I think there's something called price and cost. In other words, how much they buy the parts for. And I think Accutex have to go back to their suppliers and try and fight for better prices on their on their parts and fight all the time. You know, we allow the price to go up and up and up. If you go back to your supplier and maybe fight a little bit more, maybe you can bring the price down on, on some components. And then price and perception. I think this is the most important one. If a machine is perceived to be worth more than it is, customers will pay more than it's worth. 
and then price and positioning. And I think, like we discussed earlier, maybe in in a country where you have no machines and a big fight against one manufacturer, maybe the factory should offer some price to allow Acutex to position itself in that market. And we need to change that story the whole time. So I think we all need to go to our customers with the same story. So what is the story going to be for 2013? Obviously, now seeing the linear motors, maybe the story is about the linear motors. But we need a story for every year. And I think Acutex, the Laura, needs to share a story with us. And we all need to use that story to, to sell machines. And then I just want to leave you with the thought that when I leave my customers, I say the EDM shop brand is defined by what people say about us when we're not there. Thank you. Hello, everyone. After this speech, it's hard to say something fresh and new. <laughs> <laughs> so I have her job. Really, yes. <laughs> OK, Aplanalp is the Polish distributor of Acutex uh, machine. We have been doing business together for over eight years now. Yeah. First machine this was AU500. Uh, I remember we were sold in 2004. Uh, I remember this date very well. Till now, more than 60 machines. Uh... It's, uh, it's, uh, the most important thing we, we got from Architex is their support quick and uh, um, just very nice. <laughs> <laughs> Um, in the very beginning of our business, we have sold uh, Sodic machines. Uh, so, uh, in the level of support, it's the uh, same to Sodic one. Uh, because, for example, if uh, your competitors are clients who are choosing from uh, between uh, Japanese machines and Taiwanese machines. So you need to show that um, uh, your machines are quite high quality and expensive. But uh, if your competitors um, uh, are Chinese uh, machines and your and uh, the buyer is choosing between Chinese and uh, Taiwanese, so you need the first thing you need to do is to decrease your price, to cut your profit, <laughs> to sell cheaper. But uh, we are, anyway, so we are, there is many kind of the mold, you know, press mold, injection mold, and uh, semiconductor. Okay, we had, uh, we had uh, the pocket, it's a, it's a press mold. As you know, the press mold market not high accuracy. Here we are just selling to a, it's a press mold mark, it's very good. Also, we are, we, two years ago, we sold a PGL, PCB market, PCB mold market. PCB is, as you know, smartphone, you know, Galaxy 3, Galaxy iPhone. Now, with, we are architects machine selling to the, this mold, already into the market. Quality is not bad, it's okay. But as you know, there are our architects machine, there is many small, small, small problems. <laughs> yeah, you understand? I, uh, we are, I have a continuous complaint to them, and, uh, Mr. Yang, Mr. Jerry, every day I phone call to them, please, please, and Mr. Jojo Chan. Now, anyway, so the uh, architects, you know, the uh, president, everybody, they are always uh, very positive thinking, positive thinking, you know, we are continuously improving the uh, machine quality. It's the uh, last year, end of last year, we are uh, installed eight or ten units. Washing quality is very good. It's perfect. It's not bad. Very good. I think that in the uh, after five years, two years, three years, well, our machine quality will be number one. In the also uh, in the after five years so will be number one or two in the architects in the world market. You know, uh, please we, we do have any everybody we do have the confidence to sell the architects machine. You know, will be so in the future. Okay. Fourth to send it to Mr. Kim. Okay, thank you. Take a photo, take a photo. Mr. Kim is putting full efforts on the thank selling you, in Korea. You. Wonderful. Thank you, Mr. Kim. Okay.
Just new coming out last year for straight cut only. So because no U and B, so cannot do the taper cutting. AU the new model is 1.4 meters X travel, and but Z X is only 200, especially for the mold making. So this uh, is a rough idea for your information. Now we have made almost 100% uh, is Japanese made machine, but cut serious made in China. Mitsubishi, made in Tianjin, Sodic, made in Thailand. Mr. Sun, am I correct? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So what's the best uh, benefit of the linear motor? Uh, I have test you the linear motor. The, first, the, the big one is replace the both school because it's, uh, both school have wear problem. So the linear motor almost have no backlash. And uh, you can see the the this the ball bar diagram. Uh, this is show the when the post wheel uh, wheel. Uh, so the error come come here when the direction change, and the when and the 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 backlash when backlash backlash happened, you cut the uh, a circle. The, you can find the, the four point have a mark because the the, the backlash problem. The parameter. Uh, and the four page, the fourth page, you can see the uh, catalog. Uh, so you can see uh, this machine ends its cutting on a very simple uh, interface. Uh, you just you just uh, uh, type the uh, type the IP address and connect. Then you can log in uh, to see what you want. And uh, first of all, I will introduce my team. Uh, the first one is me. I'm Jerry. I'm Mary. And my age is the 38 years old. It's me. Okay. <laughs> Three sub department, uh, five members. They are take care of service. Sometimes, I say, sometimes we have problem between here, because we always believe. Architect's machine, we designed it, we made it so we know every detail thing inside. Just need your help. The service guy here, five person, raise your hand. This is your job. And my job, of course, we should have good communication. So please keep uh, this five point in your mind. Every time you should feed back to us what happened and uh, take the picture and to show us uh, what is the, the voltage they measure and what is the, uh, uh, the LED display and tell us uh, what is the voltage they measure so we can check the problem in a short time. And also we face some uh, design problem or manufacturing problems 
So uh, you're an engineer, and they find a major reason, and they find a cable is bended, especially on a big machine. So they suggest us, please reorganize the design, uh, the, the, uh, the assembly about the cable, and the problem would be uh, disappeared. Okay, I'll put it on the